Hi everyone, so today I'm going to be doing my current loves. So I've just been going through the stuff that I do have and I just have some um, things I wanted to share with you that I've just been absolutely hooked on. So if you are interested in hearing what those are, then just keep watching. Okay, so before I start, I know that the lighting is so weird right now. I probably have all these little lines of um, light shining on me. Um, I do have my vanity set up in our room, but I waited so long through the day to record this. So the lighting is not that good in our room, so I'm sitting in our living room again. The first item that I've had for a really, probably a good amount of time actually, and I've just kind of started grabbing it one day and love it all over again. I've just fallen in love with this. Um, it is the NYX, actually, and I've had it for a good enough time that the label has kind of rubbed off on it, but it's the NYX, oops, I got a text, um, it's the NYX um, Mega Shine Lip Gloss, that's the name of this type of lip gloss, and it's in the color Sweetheart, and I believe I purchased this from Ulta, so you can get that there, or also order it online, and actually right now, I just got an email that terryculture.com is having 20% off all purchases on their website and they do sell NYX products so um, I just love this and I think I've just fallen in love with it again because the summertime um, I've got that nice tan going so this color just really works well with um, my skin tone right now and it's got that um, angled doe foot applicator which I really like it makes a really easy application and I'm not going to do a swatch because my lighting's been kind of you know I just said my lighting's weird and I don't know I don't want to get a mess on my hands, but um, awesome lip gloss. The only negative to this maybe is the scent, but you get past that. It's really pretty though. It just um, another item is another lip product, and this is actually limited edition, but I wanted to share it with you because just for the color tone sake, um, it's a Mac lipstick, and I got this last spring, I believe. I can't remember what collection it came out in, but it's um, the Mac lipstick. It's in a it's a luster finish and it's called cut a caper and this like I said it's limited edition but as you can see it's like this corally pink color and this is another shade that well when I first saw it I believe it was last spring or maybe even early summer when I first got it um, I, I just had to get this color I love it um, I love that coral tone and um, it would just be perfect for the summertime and it is and actually and that's why I have so much of it it's practically still brand new um, but after that summer season passes and that tan kind of goes away it's not so complimenting on the lighter shades of skin so um, tutorial, um, based around coral colors for that summertime season really like that and another item that I've had for a really long time but just never really grabbed for it um, is actually my Too Faced Shadow Insurance. Um, for those of you who watch my videos pretty regularly you probably know that I am in love 100% hands down most favorite eyeshadow primer that I have is my MAC Painterly Paint Pot. I love it and it's pretty much gone which I think that's why I kind of started reaching for this because I didn't want it to go away and my, one of my favorite things about it is probably that it has is the squeeze tube and that it has a little um, squirt tube type I don't really know the name for that but I really really bandwagon with this item but I've actually had it for a while never showed you guys but it's the EOS lip balm and it's like this little egg shaped lip balm. Now it's kind of flat. But when you first get it, it's like a round little egg shape. And um, I was just obsessed with it. This is the best lip balm I've ever used. It doesn't ever have that really gross like lip balm flavor, like that medicated kind, um, which I can't stand and probably what keeps me from using lip balm or chapstick, I guess. But this has um, jojoba butter in it, and it's very smooth and just really hydrating and moisturizing for your lips, and I love it. And it's just perfect for this time of the year because you lay out and go out on the beach, and your lips get dry when you're out in the sun and the heat. So that's just really nice to keep in my bag. Um, another item I've had for a really long time, seriously cannot stop grabbing for this product, and that is my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish. And this, again, is a limited edition from MAC, but I wanted to show you guys 
Holy crap, there is a humongous spider on the is in Refined, and this was released quite some time ago. Like I said, I've had it for a long, long time. But the mineralized skin finishes are absolutely amazing. I just absolutely love. This is my favorite. I have another. The great thing about these is that they have um, that marbleized color in it. And um, as you can see, there's kind of like a deeper dent in on this side because there's this fat chunk of that corally pink color. And I love this because what I do is I get my blush brush and I put it in this color and I put that on my cheeks, which I'm actually wearing right now. And I put it on my cheeks and then I'll, I just swirl my brush on this side where the lighter shades are um, and kind of use it as a highlight. And it's just so, so gorgeous. Um, it gives you this beautiful glow and when the light hits that, it's just this gorgeous sheen and just illuminates your face. And I really, really love that. It's this blush color for my cheek side. It is a little bit pricey. I believe these are like $26, which is pretty expensive, but I find a color that you like and it's totally worth it. And they last forever. I'm not kidding. So that's another amazing product. Another one that I've actually also had for a really, really long time is this blush and it's by the brand Flirt. Ooh, yikes. It's by the brand Flirt, which is from Cole. It's in the color 22, Sweet Desire, and it's just in this little compact that slides out and then opens up. Comes with a little brush, but I've never used that. But it is a super, super gorgeous color, and it's in that really beautiful, shimmery kind of peachy, bronzy color. And again, for this time of the year, it's gorgeous. And when I use this, I've been loving to use this as a blush and a contour because it's just kind of got those colors in it that you can use as a blush and it also works well as a bronzer and it just really, really emphasizes your cheekbones and it, so it does the two-in-one contouring and blush. It's just gorgeous. I love, love, love this shade and it's very shimmery, of course, but um, again, it's just very beautiful, golden, glowy gorgeous on your skin. I love it. Um, another product um, is my shampoo and conditioner that I've been using lately and I could not wait. This is what inspired me to do this video actually um, because I love, love, love these hair products. This is my shampoo and conditioner that I've been using and it is by the brand Organics. And so the color, or the color, the type that this is, it's the Renewing Moroccan Argan Oil. And so I have a shampoo and conditioner. The first thing that I absolutely, well, the first thing that caught my eye about this product is that it's Moroccan Argan Oil. And I know how good that is for your hair. My hair has been a little butthead lately. It's been drying out. It's been just, ugh not working with me. So I just was ready to try something new and I saw these on the shelf um, at actually at Walgreens. But you can get this brand anywhere and even at grocery stores. I've seen it at Vaughn's before. Um, so that's the first thing that caught my eye and I love the, the packaging. I'm a sucker for cute packaging. Um, I really, really like that. And um, it's 13 fluid ounces and I believe, I think I got them for sa on sale. Um, like buy one get one free or buy one get one half off. Um, but I believe they're around like, mm, they're kind of a little bit pricier than regular shampoos. I think they're around $9 each bottle. Um, but my favorite, favorite thing about this product is the smell, which, oh, oh my God. When I put this in my hair, I just like, oh God, I just want to smell it all day long. It's like this cologne type smell and it's just, I love it. I love it so much. It kind of just smells like a good man. Like, I don't know how to explain it, but it just smells so, so amazing. And it really does make your hair very soft and silky, which who doesn't want that? Who isn't looking for that in their hair um, product? But it's really good too, especially for the summertime because it says that with the argan oil, it protects from styling heat and UV damage while creating soft, seductive, silky protection. So I just really, really like this product. Um, 
I don't have any negatives about it. It's just really, really, really great. My own. Anyways, those are my current loves. Sorry for the crazy lighting and all the lines and everything else, but I hope this was helpful. Let me know if you have any questions on any of these products. And also check down below, and I will try to post the links for these products if you are interested in looking at them yourself. So I hope you guys are having a great summer, and I will see you soon. Bye.